Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will, excuse me, be reacting to episode 7 of Only Mine. So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. Just smart. Duh. Damn, finals already? Don't we all? Don't we all? Tests are literally the worst thing in the world. <laughs> are you okay? Ah, so you really hate tests. I mean, for me, it just always depended on what it was. If it was always math, uh, anything else, I was like, yes, I'm good. <laughs> nah, you by yourself. The overconfident baby. Yeah, mess up on purpose. Because no one wants to say, oh, hey, smarty pants. I know, it's so cute.
started to finish. <clears throat> oh my god. You didn't finish. I mean, you could have just told the teacher that, like, hey, you messed up. That's good, though. <laughs> Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm oh my god. <laughs> Yeah, on accident. <laughs> She's so precious. I just want to spin off all about her. No. At a time like this, baby. There you go. Uh -uh. <laughs> well, we talk about a lot of things. <laughs> 
Yeah. You just talk about whatever's on your mind. Mm hmm And so if you want to talk about video games, you can talk about video games. Hell, sometimes, you know, when we really feel like it, we always ask each other, you know, hey, where's the best place to buy a good bra? Be like, damn, did you go there? Yes. So good. <laughs> <laughs> that too we do yeah right right Can't remember, remember, remember. Yeah. Hit, hit. Nudge, nudge. I just realized I'm old. <laughs> There they go. I'm guessing the woman who just popped up is the home ec teacher. Yes. Right? <laughs> Why? What's wrong? <sighs> oh, most definitely.
There's always one in the friend group who cannot cook. Y'all ain't good either? Oh, y'all screwed. Jesus. Can't, can't y'all at least follow the instructions? Jesus, yes. Yes? Why don't you just ask Kayeter? There you go. Nah, I kind of want to get my nails done. Maybe Saturday. Huh? So, why don't you make the cookies for her? Perfect, that's the one one. That's an interesting twist. I wonder how this is gonna go though. Oh. Jesus. How was she gonna cut the cookies with the day? <laughs> oh. They look really good. Well, hell nah.
That makes me want a cookie. And funny enough, I do actually have cookies. Yeah. But of course, she's going to treasure the hell out of them. And I get that. Oh, is she gonna try one anyway? That was so fucking adorable. As hell. I really thought she was not going to eat them. Like, I mean, yes, you know, you have, like, something and someone takes the time out of it. And, of course, it's, like, the thought that counts. Like, if you make someone. Mmm. <laughs> a bomb ass, like, good. Like, a really, really good cake, cookies, whatever. Or anything that's in Japan that looks really good. I look at that and I'm like. I can't eat this. Like, I need to take pictures of it and such. Like, I, I watched this video, and somebody went to, like, the Kirby Cafe, and everything looked so freaking good. I was like, oh, my God, I want to eat it, but at the same time, it's too freaking cute. I don't want to eat it because then it's going to be gone. And I was like, no, why? I'm like, uh. <laughs> but I love the fact <laughs> that Mahiru... In his own way, yes, he got to learn about what girls talk about. I mean, yes, in our minds, like, sometimes we can talk about a whole bunch of ish. It, it's just, as I said, it's whatever's on your mind. And the fact that she, he, was talking about video games, the topic is video games. And I think most of us we can go hours upon hours upon hours talking about video games. And then if it's romance, it depends. Yeah. <laughs> That's cute. Um, oh, it's a sleepover episode! Yay! Okay, so it could literally, depending on how many people, like, okay, so let's say it is a group of four, or like me, it's a group of three, um, and let's say two of us are straight and the other one isn't, like, we, it's still okay to still talk about that. You can be like, oh my god, that's so fucking cute, like, yes. Oh. Um, sometimes we'll talk about what the heck we're reading and such you know i've had friends like come up to me even my two friends now um i read way way too much um fan fictions and stuff and, and it's worse when it's the ex-reader s word because <laughs> you don't need to know what the fuck i'm reading you just know i read a lot of fan fiction to the point that these two were asking me i gave them like really good ones and next thing you know it's like, I think I had just finished talking to them and they both sent me a message like, hey, you got something else? I'm like, damn. <laughs> I'm like, did, how, did you read it in like two seconds? Like the whole thing? I'm like, yeah, but it was so good. I couldn't put my phone down. And I'm like, bitch, take your time. Be in the moment with the with the damn story. That's how I do it. Like Jesus, I, I'm like if a if a if I'm reading a long behind story by a fan Arthur, depending on how long the chapter is, like I could read the whole chapter for like a good thirty minutes and shit. Or sometimes, like I said, we're talking about like, oh hey, I like your top. I'm like, oh thank you. Where'd you get your top? Oh hey, and then if we're if we're like 
going laundry shopping or just shopping on their own lawn. Like, oh my god, did you get this here? Yes, okay, we're gonna go there. Or if it's shoes, yes, did you get that there? Yes, we're going there. That, that's what we do. It's just girls. Be like, hey, like, mm, did you go see this? Yeah, did you like it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go see that. Let's go see that again this weekend. <laughs> you never know what the hell us girls are gonna talk about and shit. It, it's just, it's good. Our conversations that we have are freaking hilarious. But it's also interesting that he got to also talk to the guys today. I mean, because, like, ever since she's gone, started to go into school, and I've seen them in the background, I'm like, I wonder when they're going to have, like, a somewhat speaking role. But the fact is, he's like, yeah, oh, my God, have you played six? And then one of them says, oh, my God, like, I, you know, that came up before I was born. Poor baby just realized how old he was <laughs> in that moment. And I felt for him. <laughs> it's like how okay <laughs> it's so funny to compare it to this okay so me who loves the shit out of kingdom hearts playing it since 2002 which is still fucking crazy to say it is so interesting and still a little weird but still fun at the same time people who are like five years younger than me or even 10 years younger than me getting into the series and then you explain to them what this is that is and they look at you like what the fuck are you talking about anybody who gets into kingdom hearts and who especially if you know me and such it's a wild ride <laughs> it is so freaking hilarious to just explain to someone because of course kingdom hearts is a very lore based story and series and such because you're not going to get like every you're going to get every single information in every game but you're still going to be confused on a lot of things. That's why you have people like me who we, even though we are still confused on them, some things, we still understand the plot. And when you're explaining to someone about this, once again, they look at you like, what are you talking about? But it, it's funny. It, it's so sweet. And I'm just, I want friends who also play Kingdom Hearts. Or if they have not, I want my friends to get into Kingdom Hearts. But like, oof. I'm like, yeah, I'm like, it's Disney and anime. Like, the best of both worlds. Yes. But I've met some people who don't really like Disney that much. And then I've met people who kind of like anime, but not as much. And I'm just like, okay, I'll keep, I'll keep it close to my heart. You don't get to have Kingdom Hearts with me. <laughs> oh, but I'm excited for next week. But it's the weird thing. We're almost done with the show. And we have not had a beach episode. So something tells me we're going to get that soon. Maybe. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, because it makes sense. Because, like, okay, Kaede's introduction, uh, introductory episode is them going to the, eventually going to the mall and them buying some suits. So I was like, are we ever really going to have, like, a beach episode and stuff? They show it more in the opening and not a full-fledged episode. So I think that's weird, but I mean, it's almost summertime for them. So yeah, go to the beach, hang out, get a tan, sleep on the beach. <laughs> so fucking random. Other than that, guys, that is my reaction to towards episode seven of Oni Mai. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like or that helps me out. Also subscribe to my channel and make videos if you want to enjoy the match. <laughs> Join the Master Squad, and of course, I will see you guys officially on next Thursday for episode 8. Bye, guys.